board, my name is Visibility, and today we're going to be teaching you how to make a very simple lighting setup for your scene. So, uh, this tutorial will go over how to make a simple, uh, seamless backdrop, and how to light a model correctly. Well, not correctly, but make it look good. So basically, the first thing we're going to do is hit X and delete our default cube, and we're going to add a plane. I forgot what the plane was for a second. I'm going to scale it up. Doesn't really matter how much you scale it up, it just depends on how big your model is or whatever. Personal preference, really. And I'm going to tab into edit mode and select one of these uh, edges with edge select selected. And I'm going to press E and Z and scale it or extrude up on the Z axis. And now I'm going to click on this edge down here and click Control B and bevel it. Then I'm going to use my scroll wheel to add more subdivisions. to about right there and then now if we uh, tap out of edit mode you can see now we have these little lines right here and the way to get rid of those is if we right click on the plane and shade smooth they now go away so now we have this seamless backdrop and I'm actually gonna select this edge and just bring it forward a little bit just so it's not as big okay so now we have our seamless backdrop I'm actually going to so now we have our seamless backdrop and what we're going to do from here is we're going to add in our model. So I'm just going to add in a uh, monkey head. And I'm going to bring it up a little bit. To rotate it a little bit this way. Oops. So a little bit that way. Rotate it a little bit that way. Oops. Rotate it a little bit that way. And then rotate it a little bit this way. Then I'm going to bring it down a little bit to where it's like on the floor. Then I'm going to set up our camera angle, which is going to be here. Uh, I'm just going to grab my camera and move it a little bit to where it's about right there. I'm going to move this back a little bit to where it's about right there. Okay, so now we have that. So let's set up our lights. So delete this uh, default light that's here. And uh, shift A and add a uh, area lamp. Now we're going to bring this up and bring it over to where it's like right above our camera. And I'm just going to rotate it to where it's forward, kind of like that, okay? I'm also going to set our world settings to where it's completely black, so we don't have any uh, other light kind of bleeding through. So now if we go into render mode, we can see that uh, we have this light, but I kind of want it to be more dynamic. So uh, let's add two more lights. And so I'm just going to shift D this, I'm moving over here, and I'm going to rotate it like this. And we're going to bring it over like this. I'm also going to bring it back a little bit. Then you can see in rendered view if it looks good. That does look good. So that's what I'm going to do there. And now I'm going to shift D and bring it over here. Rotate this again to where it's facing the camera. And that looks pretty good. So I'm going to bring it over this way. Now if we look here. We now have a side light, back light, and a front light. I'm actually going to move this just a little bit like that. And so now we have this kind of thing. And so I'm just going to add a material to it real quick uh, by giving it uh, probably that material. Uh, so now we have this, uh, and it looks pretty cool. Uh, you see now your model is lit in both ways. Uh, I'm so funny, aren't I? <laughs> but... Uh, now your model is lit and everything looks pretty cool. Uh, you can change these if you want. Like, I wouldn't recommend bloom in the scene uh, or anything really in the scene unless you have it specifically made for the scene. But you can go ahead and adjust those. Uh, bloom, obviously, you don't want in the scene, but other things you might want. So go ahead and experiment with those. So that's it for the tutorial, guys. If you guys liked it, make sure to smack the like button and the thumb. That really helps the channel out. Uh, my name is Visibility. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.